Have you ever wondered how fire extinguishers are made? It's a question that might not cross your mind until you're in dire need of one. Our journey begins in the early 19th century with a man named George William Manby. In the year 1818, Manby, an English inventor, brought the world its first fire extinguisher. Can you imagine it? The first model was far from the sleek red cylinders we're familiar with today. It was essentially a cask that held a fire extinguishing liquid designed to be under pressure. The concept was simple. When a fire breaks out, release the pressure, and the liquid would rush out to douse the flames. This was a revolutionary invention, a game-changer in fire safety. It marked the beginning of a journey towards a future where we could actively combat fires instead of helplessly watching them grow. From these humble beginnings, the fire extinguisher has come a long way. Over the years, fire extinguishers have gone through numerous transformations. From humble beginnings as a simple cask, these indispensable safety tools have evolved into the modern handheld device we recognize today. In the early days, fire extinguishers were rather rudimentary. They consisted of a cask filled with water or in some cases a primitive form of fire retardant. However, as our understanding of fire and its properties grew, so too did the sophistication of these devices. One of the most significant evolutions in fire extinguisher technology came in the early 20th century with the introduction of carbon tetrachloride. This chemical was highly effective at quenching flames and its adoption marked a major step forward in fire safety. However, as with many early technological advancements, it came with its own set of problems. Carbon tetrachloride was found to be harmful to the ozone layer and potentially toxic if inhaled, leading to a shift towards safer materials in later years. The mid-20th century brought about the development of the modern pressurized fire extinguisher. These devices use a variety of extinguishing agents including foam, dry chemical and carbon dioxide, depending on the type of fire they're designed to combat. This flexibility, combined with their portable design, has made them an essential tool in fire safety. The design of fire extinguishers has also seen a significant evolution. Early models were large, cumbersome, and required significant effort to operate. Modern extinguishers on the other hand, are compact, lightweight, and can be operated with one hand. They also feature easy-to-read pressure gauges and clear operating instructions, making them accessible to virtually anyone in an emergency situation. Further advancements in fire extinguisher technology continue to emerge with innovations like aerosol extinguishers, water mist extinguishers, and even extinguishing sound waves being explored. Each new development brings us closer to a world where the devastating impact of fire can be mitigated more effectively. These changes were not only in design but also in the materials used, making fire extinguishers safer and more effective. Today, fire extinguishers are a blend of engineering and chemistry. They are meticulously designed and crafted to be our first line of defense when a fire breaks out. The manufacturing process begins with the creation of the cylinder, the heart of the extinguisher. This is typically made of high-strength steel or aluminum to withstand the pressure of the contents. Once the cylinder is formed, it is rigorously tested to ensure it can withstand the pressures it will be subjected to. Next comes the addition of the fire extinguishing agent. The type of agent used is dependent on the type of fire the extinguisher is designed to combat. For example, water is used to extinguish ordinary combustibles like wood and paper, while carbon dioxide is used for electrical fires. There's also a dry chemical powder for flammable liquids and gases, and a wet chemical for cooking oils and fats. Each extinguishing agent has its unique properties, and their selection is a critical part of the manufacturing process. But it doesn't stop there. The agent is then pressurized inside the cylinder, ready to be unleashed at a moment's notice to suppress a fire. But how can we be sure that when we need a fire extinguisher, it will work as expected? This is where quality control comes into play. Each and every fire extinguisher produced undergoes rigorous testing. This includes pressure tests, weight checks, and even discharge tests. These checks ensure that the extinguisher is reliable and will perform when it's needed the most. The manufacturing process of fire extinguishers is an intricate dance of technology and chemistry all working together to create a device that we hope we'll never have to use, but are grateful to have if we do. It's a testament to our advancements in safety and science, and the commitment of manufacturers to saving lives and property. Quality control ensures that when you need a fire extinguisher, it won't let you down. And that's the beauty of these life-saving devices. They stand ever ready, ever vigilant, offering us a lifeline in the face of danger. Fire extinguishers play a crucial role in our everyday safety. These unassuming devices often overlooked in the corners of our homes and workplaces 
stand as silent guardians, ready to spring into action at the first sign of danger. Their primary role? To prevent small fires from escalating into major disasters. A minor kitchen mishap or a short-circuited wire might seem insignificant, but in the absence of an immediate response, these sparks can rapidly grow into uncontrollable infernos. This is where fire extinguishers step in, acting as the first line of defense, nipping the threat in the bud before it has a chance to spread and cause irreparable damage. But their importance doesn't stop at the domestic front. In commercial settings, the presence of fire extinguishers is even more crucial. Think about it. Large buildings, factories, and warehouses are often stocked with materials that can easily fuel a fire. Add to this the high density of people and the potential for disaster is all too clear. Fire extinguishers in these environments not only help to prevent property damage but also play a vital role in ensuring the safety of individuals present. However, the mere presence of a fire extinguisher is not enough, it's just as essential to know how to use one properly. In the face of a fire, time is of the essence. The difference between controlling a fire and becoming a victim to it can often come down to a matter of minutes, sometimes even seconds. Knowing how to operate a fire extinguisher can make all the difference. So, let's not underestimate the role of these humble devices in our lives. They may not be glamorous or exciting but they are indispensable. They are the unsung heroes of safety, always on standby, always ready to protect us from the destructive power of fire. A fire extinguisher is a small device but its impact can be life-saving. 